class 7 biology we will discuss question answers of chapter 5 health and hygiene part 1 give reasons for the following statement number 1 allergy is an overreaction of body's immune system allergy is an overreaction of body's immune system because when a harmless substance such as dust or pollen is encountered by a person who is allergic to that substance, the immune system, sub, sorry, the immune system may overreact. Number two, food allergy can affect cardiovascular system. Food allergy can affect cardiovascular system because the combination of physical stress and a weakened immune system leads to a weakening of the heart muscle and can develop into heart muscle inflammation. Number three, it is more difficult to diagnose perineal allergy. It is more difficult to diagnose a perineal allergy because prolonged nasal congestion may have other causes and it is not easy to find a connection between the symptoms and the allergen. Number 4. Preventing an allergen is not an easy task. Preventing allergen is not an easy task because allergens are present everywhere in the environment and it is very difficult to find the allergen towards the body of an individual is exposed. Number B. Answer in short. 1. What is an allergen? Give three examples. Allergen is the substance that triggers an allergy. Three examples are dust, sunlight and certain food items. Number two, name any five common allergenic foods. Any five common allergenic foods are egg, fish, milk, peanuts and wheat. Number three, list the modes of entry of allergens. Allergens can enter the body through four main routes, nose and mouth by inhalation, the gastrointestinal tract, the skin, the circulatory system through either an injection or a medication or an insect sting. Number four, how does the body react to allergens in air? Allergens in the air can cause hay fever, asthma or conjunctivitis. Number 5. List the factors on which treatment of allergies depends upon. The treatment of allergies depends on the symptoms, the severity of allergy and its type. At length. Number 1. A. Explain the following terms. Dust mites. These are teeny creatures which are not visible to the naked eyes. They feed on the dead skin of humans and animals. Number 2. Food allergen. Food allergens are typically naturally occurring proteins in foods that cause abnormal immune responses. Perineal allergy. The allergy that occurs year round and not in any particular season is called perineal allergy. Number 4. Anaphylaxis. This is a condition where by blood pressure drops along with an impaired breathing. Number B. Answer in detail. What is allergy? What are the most common symptoms of allergy? Allergy is an overreaction of the body's immune system to certain substances which are otherwise harmless and do not affect most people. The most common symptoms of allergy are eczema. It is an inflammation of the skin chiefly characterized by rashes itching and outbreak of lesions. Asthma. This is an allergic reaction caused due to pollens, dust, mold spores and result in difficulty in breathing and wheezing. Hives. This is also an allergic reaction to a drug or food and characterized by the formation of itchy red or white raised patches. Number 2. How does a human body react to an allergen? The body reacts to different allergens in different ways. They are as follows. Allergens in the air can cause hay fever, 
asthma or conjunctivitis. Allergies in food can cause itching and swelling of the lips and throat, diarrhea, hives, anaphylaxis, etc. Allergies that come into contact with the skin can cause reddening, itching and blistering. Allergen can enter the body through bites and stings and go directly into the bloodstream and exert their effects. Number 3. Explain the two types of allergy. The two types of allergies are seasonal allergy. If the allergy becomes evident only at certain times of the year, it is a seasonal allergy and perennial allergy. If the allergy symptoms occur year round and not in any particular season, it is a perennial allergy. Question number 4. What steps should be taken to lessen the symptoms of allergy caused due to house dust? The steps that should be taken to lessen the symptoms of allergy caused due to house dust are as follows. Remove items that collect dust such as carpets, magazines, etc. Replace draperies and shades with blinds. Cover mattresses and pillows with finely woven fabrics that cannot be penetrated by dust mites and allergen particles. Expose linen and blankets to sunlight frequently. Clean the house regularly including dusting. Discourage breeding of dust mites. Question number 5. Write a note on allergens. The substances that trigger an allergy are called allergens. The most common allergens are as follows. Dust. Dust is composed of teeny mud particles and many allergy triggers. The allergy triggers present in dust are as follows. Dust mites. These are teeny creatures which are not visible to the naked eyes. They float in the air and are found in every corner of our house. Pollen grains. They are very light and are easily carried away by wind for long distances. They cause allergic reactions in some people when inhaled. Mold spores. Molds are microscopic spores that float in the air. They require warm and moist conditions to grow and divide. Number B. Sunlight. Allergic reactions due to sunlight is generally seen as itchy rashes on the skin which is exposed to sun. Certain medications may also cause sensitive to sun. They are harmless but cause allergy. In people allergic to sun rays. Food items. Food allergy occurs when the immune system recognizes certain food items as harmful and overreacts. It can also cause life threatening effects like anaphylaxis. Allergens enter through nose, mouth, skin, and through either an injection or an medication or an insect sting. So, see you students, we are ending our exercise portions. In our next video, we will discuss, review your learning of this chapter. Thank you.